Okay, next we're gonna we're gonna change uh, change the needle. I'm gonna show you how to change a needle. Uh, so you want to get like a good little screwdriver, and there's a little set screw that you just turn like half a turn, and you can drop the old needle out like this. Now the reason you would change a needle, first of all, would be if the needle is dull or blunt, if it doesn't poke you, it's usually dull. You can feel if it's not sharp or that type of thing because a needle will cause skipping stitches on any sewing machine. So make sure you always use a, a nice new fresh needle. Uh, and the way you put one in is make sure you bring the needle bar all the way up to the top. Now the needle itself has a a one inch groove you can feel with your fingernail. You can run it right in there, you can feel it. It's about an inch long. Then on the direct side of that, opposite side of that, sorry, there's a what they call a little ridge here. Okay, so you have the ridge and you have the one inch groove here. The one inch groove you want to make sure that when you put that needle in, faces directly to the left at, let's say, 9 o'clock. Okay, so you want to put the needle in you can loosen that set screw a little bit more to get it up there. You want to line it up, bring the needle all the way up, and before you tighten the screw Make sure you feel that long one inch groove with your finger nail. Make sure it's at nine o'clock. Then go ahead and tighten the set screw with the screwdriver. Tight and then another quick turn to make sure it's snug real tight. And check yourself when it's in. Make sure that that one inch groove is directly at nine o'clock on the left hand side. You can, you, like I say again, you can feel it with your fingernail. And then on the exact opposite side is that scarf or groove that we were talking about earlier. So that's how you put a new needle in your sewing machine.